effective. This is a great opportunity. We have lost contact with security command. Protocol Zulu has been initiated. Requesting immediately reinforcements. Site command has been evacuated. Communications with the outside world has been cut off, including Randall Corporation, SCP Foundation, Umbrella Corps, Black Mesa, and the Foundation. What about our main office? Same story. Where the hell are the reinforcements? Sector A4 down. Sector C8 down. Sector R2 down. What the hell is going on there? Why aren't the defenses working? Where are the special response teams? They're not responding. My god. This site is suffering multiple containment breaches. Specimen Z has escaped. We need to reinforce those entrances. That's a good idea. She's awake. Hey, you're finally awake. Sorry for not being able to give you uh, more of a suitable sleeping place. I left your stick over there. Speaking of sleeping, did you have a nice dream? Well, any dream is better than the mess we're in right now. Look, I know this is hard, but I promise your father that I will look after you, and I tend to keep that promise. I'm a cop after all. Oh, uh, by the way, your dad gave this to me. Do you know what this is? Let's see. Well, I guess you're as curious as I am about the content of this thing. But let's put that aside first. We have other things to worry about right now. Hey, Aaron. It's been a while. How are you doing? I'm fine, Sean. Thanks. Do you know what orders are from the safe house? I have no idea. I guess they're here somewhere. Um, who's the girl? She's just a daughter of a friend who I made a promise that I will look after her, which I do. Oh, uh, okay, I see. It's a long story. Come to think of it. You might be safe here in the safe zone, but still. I wonder how the outside world is currently doing. Well, consider us lucky that we even made it here in the first place. I'm a cop. It's my job to protect and serve. There are still people out there who are not as lucky as we do. This virus has been considered to be one of the worst since the discovery of the Motaba virus. My fellow citizens, in order to combat this situation, it has been decided to declare a state of emergency. Please stay indoors until further instructions of the UN military. <laughs> It is nothing we have happened. Stop fooling around. I'm not going to wait any longer. We have to leave now.
have surpassed over 10,000 alone in Taylor C. We have lost contact with the French in Busan. We can all assure you that the quarantine in West Brickford will only be for a short while. Please follow the instructions given by the soldiers. According to rumors, they consider a nuclear strike. You're kidding me, right? No, they are just rumors, but I don't know. You're going to be alright. Prepare for evac. The wounded get priority. Please follow the instructions given by the soldier. Alright, get these civilians to the quarantine zone for medical checkups. Don't want any code reds after what happened in London. Uh, sir, are you sure this is the right location? According to the map, we have to go to the safe house located in a school building. Hey, never doubt my mapping skills. We have received new orders to act as a rear guard for Rescue 11, while they handle the air and ground evacuation of the civilians. Copy. Shall we go to the rooftops? No. Look at that. Bitch, look on the bright side. At least we have the high ground. I'm not sending you guys in there. I mean, who the bloody hell does that? I we can hear you. Captain, we lost contact with Rescue 11. I have a bad feeling about this. This is just what happened last time. Prepare your weapons and shoot anything that runs like a madman on Bartholz trying to eat your face. Ah! <laughs> Man! Why in the bloody hell was no one firing? Well, we were supposed to fire when they came running towards us. Ah! Open fire! Throw everything you've got! What is the status of the evacuated civilians? Any casualties? Evac is still in progress. We have to hold this position. What are they, insane? We can't hold this defensive position for a long time. Request for immediate air support before it's too late. Oh, bloody hell! These things don't know when to quit! <laughs> Fall back, everyone fall back. Fall back! Copy. Defense side Bravo, we are falling back. On the beach, we are falling back. Combat efficiency is below 10%. We are losing his life. Yes. You 
Roman military suspended all airlift operations in various districts as the quarantine zone Mesa has been breached. If you are in a safe house, then it is recommended that you stay there until further instructions. Further news, the safe zone in Jerusalem has fallen. And that is the end. Marcus, turn that off. There's nothing but stuff about this outbreak on the news. Come on, Rebecca. Do you really think that the media is lying to us, or the government is lying to them? Wait, what? Marcus, Rebecca, can you get Jackie to this room? There is something I want to discuss with all of you. What? Why me? Can't Marcus go alone or something? I mean, Jack is just in two rooms next to us. Well, excuse me! Remember rule number two, never go alone in the hallway. Wait, wasn't rule number two double tap? No, just take Mary and go get Jackie. If you say so. You heard him. Let's go. Yes, sir. Say, Simon, this is kind of odd, don't you think? I mean, we have solar panels, water basins, and a garden on the rooftop. Like this building is built for a zombie apocalypse. Yes, I... I guess we're just lucky. The only reason the two of us survived is because I give you detention for skipping classes. Well, most students and faculty members went home during the outbreak. And please call me Mr. Anderson. Despite that this world has gone to hell, I'm still your teacher. Speaking of teachers, why did you even become one? I don't think protecting students against man-eating cannibals is written in your resume. You could have just ran away and left us to die, but instead you did not. You know, Rebecca, I was wondering that myself, why I became a teacher. There are things even I don't know. <laughs> This is Saoyu International School. I'm sending a distress signal. Is anyone out there who can hear this distress signal? I'm outside, bro. What the hell are you doing outside, you moron? Get to a safe house! Mm, it is getting tiresome. Kinda wonder how mom and dad are currently doing. I hope they are fine. Of course they are fine. They will survive. They always do. Right? Local law enforcement are completely hey, overrun. Hey, Jackie. How are things going? Did you manage to call for help? Yeah, of course. Oh, really? Of course not. Norman is responding to a distress calls. The only messages I receive are either other distress calls from other people who are in the same situation as us, screaming for military personnel, some preacher claiming that something about a singularity engine and that this is the fault of Black Mesa and some loop messages from some listening outposts. So, what you're saying is... They've abandoned us. Oh, look on the bright side. Well... I don't know any yet, but I can think of one. You kinda suck at this, don't you? Why are you guys even here? Um, Simon wants to see us. What? Why? Tell him I'm busy. Oh, come on. Didn't you just say that this was pretty much useless? I just don't want to be near Rebecca. She's kind of scary. Well, that might be true. But she isn't that scary, right? I mean, you survived by running back at school for some whacking reason without getting bitten. No. Wait, Mary, Marcus, no, wait, wait, can we talk about this? They're going to get you, Barbara. What is bothering you, Rebecca? This sucks. Do you think we're going to live another day? I really doubt my is ever coming. Jackie is just wasting electricity. Of course we will make it. Listen, Rebecca, it is the duty of a teacher to look after his students, and I will uphold that duty. That said, we can't stay here forever. We may have electricity and water, but we will eventually run out of food. We need to think of a place to go and how to get there. Jackie is just trying to give himself and all of us hope, even in the darkest hours. Hope is something that we all need to hold on tight. I promise you, when one of you breaks, I will pick up the pieces. Gee, Simon, you don't have to be that dramatic. Dang it, Rebecca, it's Mr. Anderson. Thanks a lot, you guys. We're back. Hey. So why did you call us, Simon? Ah, yes, Marcus. How are the barriers holding? Well, we are kind of running out of tables and nails, but they're still holding. Why? We are currently low on stocks. 
So that's why I'm planning to expand the safe zone. Are you sure? I mean, we still have the garden. The garden won't be enough to supply to five of us for a long time. Pack the necessary stuff, despite we have cleared up the upper floors. There might be some infected roaming the halls downstairs. Simon, you sure this is wise? There's a lot more of them now. So you've noticed that too? Come on, Rebecca. Don't be such a downer. I mean, we have you, a real zombie killer, on our side. Yeah, he's right for once. Uh, take that off, Marcus. You don't need that. Don't be like that, Rebecca. Remember Rule 32? Enjoy the little things? This is not the moment for goofing around. <laughs> that really hurts. I'll use the force. <laughs> find some real swords instead. Stop, you are moving out. They've left us for dead. Open fire. You can't trust someone without a gas mask. Oh, god damn it, you gotta be kidding. <laughs> now what? Kidding it! Sao Seng, you don't need to be so bad. What's going on here? We have cleared the east wing. So let me get this straight. You are a police officer who survived two different sea force beaches. One near the witches' pub, and one near the Thanks, city hall or something. So Along with the strangest zombie survival team someone can imagine. And the girl standing next to you is the daughter of a dead friend of yours. Who you promise to look after? Yes. Eh, fine by me. After I saw people getting bitten and turned into zombies, and people buying train tickets to Busan, I don't know what's weird anymore. Sir, we have received a distress signal from Zhao Yu International School. What are your orders? Zhao Yu? Wasn't that supposed to be a safe house that for some reason never got activated? Hold up. Activator? What do you mean by that? That's classified officer. Look, it's too dangerous to send troops to that location. It's in the middle of the hot zone and I don't want I don't to waste like valuable resources in fruitless attempts to rescue a bunch of kids. We already have the strange valley girl from Zhao Yu International School over there. No, Matt! Like, did someone say Zhao Yu International School? Man, let me tell you, like, that place is, like, full of, like, crime. What have you done? I'm sorry, no. Captain Chu from the Flying Tigers. I'm sorry, but we can't afford to lose another team of elite tactical units. Alright, fine. We'll prepare a helicopter, but it won't be easy since most airlift operations have been suspended in this region. Oh, sir. Hold up. You're a, you're a pretty good guy. With a little more people like us uh, in this world. Especially now. So, uh, good luck. Stay alive. Task Force say say say. When you got to Did you ever heard of Task Force 444? Zombie! We have a zombie in the dungeon! What are you talking about? We don't even have a dungeon here! Uh, I mean, uh... We have a breach in Sector 7. Someone left the window open! Wait, not again! Oh no! It's the vampires! What? No, you baboon! It's the infected! Did you mad zombie? No! Don't say the C-word! It's ridiculous! <laughs> <laughs> Delta Command, this is Echo 2 5. Mission for takeoff, over. Commission granted, Echo 2 5. Copy, over. I don't know what the hell I saw, but the hallway is clear now. Sector 
coast clear. Not clear, not clear. I'm sorry. I guess we don't need real swords after all. Close, children. Mr. Joe? Mr. Joe! Oh, wait, Marcus! Die, Mr. Joe! Die! <laughs> you never gave me good grades! Die! 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 Witness me! Damn it, Marcus, that's enough! Oh, um, sorry you guys had to see that. That was the old me. Dude. Next time, don't screw things up like this. Your fighting style was way off. This is how you fight. Damn. Go back out, watch out! Guys, I don't want to spoil the mood, but there's a lot more of them now. Well then, let's get out of here! We're approaching the building. You have 10 minutes to extract the survivors. Out of the way! Oh no, these bitches ain't gonna whoop my ass! Ah! Fall back! Fall back! You're right. You're not my daughter. And I sure as hell ain't your dad. In other military news, the 42nd Squad has been redeployed to deal with the recent civil unrests. Ah! What a deep hole. Do you hear that? Well, I'll be damned. I told you it wasn't a waste. Yeah, we're saved. Simon, did you hear that? We're saved. Rescue's coming. It's, it's not over yet, Rebecca. Simon, are you alright? Here, take this. What is it? You've been bitten? What? Yeah, yeah, I screwed up. Listen, you need to go. We're not leaving you. Yeah, we're not leaving you behind. I bet the army has some sort of antidote or cure. Maybe you're immune, Simon. You don't understand. There is no cure. I don't care, you're coming with us. Hurry, let's go. What are you waiting for? Hurry up, Simon. You were always a very odd student of mine. Please look after your fellow friends. <gasps> Wait! <laughs> Rebecca, you alright? Oh, no! Simon, let me go! Damn, let me go, Simon! It's still in there! No! Take Rebecca! You can't! You can't go back! <laughs> Wait! Don't cry, Rebecca. 
Please forgive me, my students, for not being able to protect you till the very end. I can feel my mind slipping away. It's more bottomless than this. Simon, please! We can't go on without you! Please open this door! I really suck at being a teacher, don't I? Always wonder why I became one. Well, Rebecca, I can finally answer that question. Would you like to hear it? <laughs> please, no! She had to be crying like that since Titanic. Rebecca, I, um, we're sorry. But listen, Rebecca, we have to leave now. If we stay any longer, then Simon's sacrifice will be in vain. Sacrifice? Sacrifice? He didn't need to sacrifice himself. This all happened because I let my guard down. It's my fault. It's all my fault. Don't blame yourself, Rebecca. Yeah, let us blame you. Ow! That hurts! Okay, okay. We will stop fooling around. Listen, Rebecca, this isn't your fault. None of this is. But we need to stay together. We need to help each other. That's what friends do. Because if I have a break, then I would like to have someone who will pick up the pieces. We are all sad, Rebecca. But we can grieve later. For now, we need to go. So what do you say? Yeah. Well, that was pretty corny. Come, let's go. All be back. What are you in position? Okay, we got this. Boy, they don't see now. Roger. Oh, oh. Oh, hell no. Hey, you're not going to Who are you guys? I'm Captain Ju. We are Flying Tigers. We received your distress signal and came to rescue you. So it's only four of you? Yeah, it's just us. Echo 25, this is Bravo Team. We're going to take you to Copy. Over. Mayday, ah! Mayday. This is Echo 25. What was that? Go, 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 go! Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, Oh, yeah. Oh, Jackie, if you're listening to this, I just want to let you know that we're safe. In your face! Rebecca! 
God damn it! Damn, son. Sir, this is a potential combat zone. Why do you think it's wise to bring a little girl here? She's way stronger than one might expect. Besides, I'm not going to leave her out of my sight. Any luck with contacting the rescue team? They'll manage. At least they didn't send those guys. Hey. Do you underestimate the awesome power of the biggest weapon in our arsenal, the Panzerbücher? By sending us here as well. We have spotted one armored vehicle heading this way, followed by a horde of infected. We need any help we can get, including this sniper. Make sure you shoot them in the head. Mm, bitch, please! I'm a professional sniper. Like my uncle, I never miss. <laughs> Uh, weren't you a professional sniper? Well, I didn't miss. Care to explain why many of you didn't pull the trigger? Well, uh, we got a professional sniper on our side, so uh, we thought uh, he can handle it. Oh, you got to be kidding. I have a bad feeling about this. Over fire! Over fire! Machine Gun Sword! Fatality.